Hello, guys. Good evening. Now that you are over there, Susie. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Estaba escondiendo. <laughs> Poquito. Uh, your curtains look like mine. Tus cortinas se ven como las mías. Yo tengo unas parecidas. Uh, it's very pretty. Yeah, they're pretty. Yeah. So, um, let's see who else. Susie. Ya decía. Curada. 100%. Sí, totalmente. Sí, ya, mejor. Better. Pues, uh, Ready for... Ya puedo dar guerra otra vez. Eso te iba a decir. Ya lista para el relajo. Ok, good. I like to hear that. Ya escuché esa sonrisa de malvada de tipo rosa de Guadalupe. Gracias. Me hacía falta también a mí. Ok, fine, fine. Let's see here we have also Andrea. Hello, Andreita. Hi, teacher. Hi, everything okay? Yep. Yep. Okay, perfect, perfect. We have Carmen. She looks really busy. Te ves ocupadita, Carmen. Hey, good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? Good? Good. Good. Okay, fine, fine. And here we have also, let's see, Diego not wearing cap for the first time in the history of this class. Right, Diego? <laughs> Not teacher, it's too hot. Yeah, really? Yeah, this is the reason why I, I wear it yeah. my best too. Yeah, because you love it, right? You love wearing caps. Yeah. <laughs> I got it one. Okay, right here, okay. How I many, how many caps do you have? I have one, two, three, five caps. Five. Different colors or all in black? Yeah. The most are black. Dark colors. Three black, yes. so one blue, and, and and one camouflage, or I don't know some. Okay, they, they are they are they combine a lot. Okay. So yo se mira diferente Diego. Yes, she looks she looks <laughs> younger or she. Uh, I'm sorry, he looks younger or older. Más joven. Uh, ma, in ma, my opinion, a little older. Or uh, a little, a little. Are you sure? Okay. <laughs> I'm not a boy. That is sure. <laughs> okay, Andrea. <laughs> Younger or older? Um, how, how does he look like? Little younger. Little younger. Me ha están haciendo el paro, okay? <laughs> how they say? <laughs> okay. Thank you so much. Perfect. Okay, good. Carito, Caro, line. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello. And what happened with the straight hair? With the with the model hair? Is the hot? Ah, the hot as well. Yes, it, it is getting hotter even. Está haciendo más calor todavía, más caliente. Okay, yes. Yes, of course, that's it. Um, what about Carla? Hello, Carla. Good evening. Hello, teacher. The tattoo girl, right? Yes. With many tattoos. Are you planning to have another this year or the next year? Other? Otro tatuaje? No. No, 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 not by the moment. Okay, fine. No. Fine, let's wait. Vamos a ver. Okay, later. Here, uh, Helen, hello. Good evening, Helen. Are you there? Helen. Okay, yeah, she's going to appear in a, in a minute. Diana, good evening. Good evening. Mm, are you okay? Finishing your, your dinner. Mm. Sí, eso or sí, having bien. or having your dinner. Okay, okay. To your time. Go ahead. Okay. Gracias. I I know it, it is it is difficult, but later you turn on the camera. Okay. 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 Perfect. Yeah, I mean, you're going to be participating and listening. Okay. Enjoy okay. your meal. And provide. Okay. Um, we have also Marlon. At least Marlon, like a kind of formal Marlon, not a rock yes, star. Really. Not a rock star tonight, right? You are the Good architect. Evening. I'm sorry, I can't hear you very well because it's raining. Oh, and really? It's raining. And what about yes, your and headphones? And your headphones? I have I have problem with my my cell phone. Uh, I have earphones, but my cell has problems. It's not working. No funciona. Maybe the plugging. Yes. Uh, mm -hmm. 
ponerlo con otro celular, pero era bien engorroso, sí, el, el tema de estar cambiando el dispositivo. Yes, I todo, know, todo. I know. Even sometimes Bluetooth uh, earphones the, don't work very well, right? Yeah, we, we sí, prefer sí, like sí. cable. Entonces, okay. yo, yo, o sea, sí tengo los audífonos, pero el, el teléfono es el que me ha fallado en, en el puerto. Yeah. Donde se the jack. The jack. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that, that happens. Okay, uh, maybe um, now can you hear me better or that's the same? But that's the same because it's raining. It's so raining, yeah. It, it's of the environment. Okay. I hope I hope uh, the rain stops. Okay, in any time. Okay, good, Marlon. Thank you for telling me that. Merci. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. You look like a nurse. Yes. Pharmacy. Yes, I know, but enfermera like hermanos flores. So. <laughs> okay, good. Veronica, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Okay, how are you doing? Good. How was your day? Good. 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 Normal. Okay. Um, tell me, what uh, what do you think is the work the worst traffic jam? El peor tráfico. The worst traffic jam that you know. Uh, maybe in San Salvador or in in what in Chalate? I don't know. No, Carmen, you're from. Don't tell me your what? family. Ah, what? Yes, I was going to say it. Okay, got it. So, but in different parts of El Salvador, eh, we do have traffic jams. Nosotros sí realmente tenemos embotellamientos, tenemos esos, uh, do, those uh, parts in the highway or on the road in which we spend a lot of time. So tell me, what what's uh, the worst traffic jam that you know. Let's listen to Veronica. Do you remember any traffic jam that affects you, que te afecta, or the, do you know? Um, yes, in Unicais. Unicais. Bypass, bypass Santa Ana. Unicais Bypass Santa Ana. Mm, I don't know it. Um, around how much time uh, does it take you to pass by there? ¿Cuánto tiempo te tardas ahí? One hour, uh, two hours. 45 oh, minutes. Oh, 45 minutes. Yeah. yeah. Kind of acceptable, but mm, okay. 45 minutes of your life. 45 minutes of your life. Okay, Carmen wants to say something. Hace poco, uh, one Friday night, we had traffic all the way to a watch park. 100 kilometers. 100. Cuatro horas y media. No. No way. Surely, uh, one hour, three minutes. Four hours of your life. Even you can get married at that time and have a party. Cuatro horas y media te puedes casar y tenés una fiesta, de hecho. ¿Verdad, Andrea? Sí. Yes, of course. There's a lot of time. It's a lot of time. Okay. Four, uh, four hours. Well, I hope not to experience that. Espero no pasar por eso, but okay. Thank you for that data. Um, how long time ago? Last year, this year, two this years ago. Year. This year, I'm <clears throat> on vacation. Antes de la vacaciones. Before. <clears throat> okay, I'm I'm so sorry for you, Carmen, but I think you were like disgusted. Ya no quería saber nada de eso. Okay. No nos hemos vuelto a ir. Yeah, <laughs> quedaron curados. Okay, yes. You can see one, maybe two movies. <laughs> two movies, right? Okay. Uh, thanks, Carmen, for uh, sharing that sad experience. Okay, Carmen. Okay. What about uh, Claudia? Hello, Claudia. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello. Hello. Good evening. You look like a DJ with those headphones. It's like you can have like a good sound. Tell me, what's the worst traffic jam? The peor embotellamiento que conoces? San Salvador. Well, in San Salvador, we have a lot of traffic jams. But do you know or do you have one traffic jam in a specific? 
one in specific. Okay, think about it. I'm sí. going. To, okay, I'm going. Uh, no, es que debe decir un tramo en específico. Near, cerca de él, next to, or if there is a. There's a boulevard. El centro. Okay. Centro de San Salvador. Okay, think about it. I'm going to ask you later. Okay, what about Susie? Mm, bueno, fue un poquito antes del 15 de diciembre, eh, el año pasado, la year in Park Cucatlán, en el Parque Cucatlán. Eh, yo venía, Park. sí, mm -hmm. yo venía de la zona de Salón y estaba un tráfico terrible. Me tardé, sin mentira, sin mentira, como cuatro horas, un poquito más de cuatro horas para llegar a mi casa. Four hours, similar to sí, Carmen. Sí, y, y era noche, y era noche, sí, eran las ocho y el tráfico no avanzaba. Y hasta que me bajé, quizás, y caminé a, a, por el Parque San José, del centro. Uh -huh. Desde el Parque San José. por ahí te quedaste un ratito. Ajá. No, no, no. Ya, era maybe, antes maybe. que entonces. <ríe> mm -hmm. no ok. Four hours, come on, people. Cuatro horas, demasiado. Ok. Hubiera comenzado a caminar antes. Maybe. Es que estaba lloviendo. Ah, raining. Ok, okay. raining. Ok, yeah. you rain. Yes, stop you. Ok, thank you. What about Mercy? The worst traffic jam. Um, no problem, the traffic. No problem. No. Wow. Uh, 15 minutes. minutes 15 uh... minutes. So you know uh, how, hacia wow. mi trabajo. Yeah, until until my workplace. Wow, mercy. You are so lucky. <laughs> Qué afortunada. Yes. Good for you. Okay, what about you, Diego? Do you have a, a special traffic jam that you love so much? Yeah, um, not really not, because I I am working from home. Yeah, but but last year, two years I ago. Uh, huh, but no, you have never experienced that. Oh, okay, but I think that the worst day is Mondays, Mondays and Fridays. Mm -hmm. Do you have any specific place? I think that where where the traffic jam mm, is like very stuck, con está estancado, or something like that. Yeah, on, on how was it named? In, in Boulevard de, de Los Proceres. Proceres. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, I think that, well, the, there are like uh, specific times in which that boulevard is stuck. Okay. So, well, thank you. Thank you. What about okay. now? Thank you. Dorita, can you hear me? El peor embotellamiento, the worst traffic jam. Good evening. Good evening. Acabo de ingresar. No escuché la Ok, pregunta. ok. Ok, later. Ok. Dorita. What about Diana? Dianita, tell me. Troncal del Norte. Ah, Troncal del Norte. Yes. Sí. Yes, that, that, that's a really hard. Yes. Sí. Okay, how, okay. Uh, okay, we have Troncal del Norte. What about if we ask to Marlon? Hello, Marlon. Can you hear me now? Yes? Yes. Okay, tell me the worst traffic jam that you know. Uh, I think it's uh, in Soyapango. It's uh, Boulevard. Uh, uh, no, no. no. Uh, from Unicentro to the, uh, the boulevard. Mm. It's a traffic jam every day in the morning. In the mornings, yes, yes. I every know. day. I have every experienced day. that. Ya lo he experimentado. <laughs> One year. Yes, and, yeah. <laughs> yes, and, and I think in Boulevard del Ejército too. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Nice, nice. Both. Eh, ahorita estamos hablando de los peores embotellamientos o, o tráfico, realmente. Okay. Que ustedes conocen o han experimentado. Okay. Helen, what about you? Hola, hola. Hello. Eh, no problem with the transport. No problem with the transportation or traffic. Okay, good. Thank you. Carla. And then Alex. Um, los chorros. Yes. Yes. Ah. 
Definitivo. Ayer salí, salimos de reunión a las 6 de Santa Tecla y por eso me conecté tarde porque casi a las 8 y 20. Ok, bien. yes, you spend a lot of time in there, ok. Thank you, thank you, yes, the chorros is very sad, triste. <laughs> yes, ok, thank you. Ok, Alex, and then Edgar. Ok, Edgar. Ok, Dorita, your turn. In Soyapango. Mm -hmm. In specific, un lugar in specific. Boulevard del Ejército. Ok, yes. Boulevard del Ejército. I can tell you one. No sé si me, si me ven bien o mi internet se está, está fallando. Aquí está lloviendo. Okay. Si sí, hay alguna falla. Ok, vamos a ver. Susi, ¿me ve bien? Por el momento sí. Okay. Y sí, está lloviendo, pero por el momento no. Ok, ok. Eh, hello, Edgar. Sí, ¿puedes escucharme? Eh, sí, yo puedo escucharlo, sí. Eh, mm -hmm. No sé, ¿puedo participar? Ok, yes, please, go ahead. Yeah. Eh, vaya, yo, vaya, aquí por donde vivo, no es, digamos, muy así para, para que se haga el tráfico. Y, y, igual, Mercy, como somos de la misma, de la misma mm -hmm. área. No wow. sufrimos. Very nice, yes, very nice. You're very Para la hora de almuerzo, nada más porque, como por los carros, va. Mm -hmm. Es la, el único momento que siento que pueda que haya tráfico. Yo, como por la moto, quizás a veces puedo. Yeah, it is, it is not a problem for you. Ok. Uh -huh. Thank you, thank you. Ok, you are very lucky, son muy afortunados. I will recommend you something. Not, oh, please don't come to Planes de Renderos on Pupusa Day. El día de la pupusa. Solo sigan mi consejo. No vengan a los Planes de Renderos. Please. It takes like, similar, like three hours and something to have the, or more to, on that traffic. And so on, and also um, 25th, December, December 25th. Yeah, that means 25 December. Or January 1st, primero de enero. Mm. Pero si quieren venir, tener un buen tráfico, adelante. So, that's uh, like very problematic. Okay, uh, we're going to start with um, the class. We have how to and need to practice. Okay, so that, that is the topic that we're going to study today. And we are on class number nine. Ya estamos en la clase número nueve. Así que necesito que el día de mañana, please, the ones who have not completed the homeworks of Unit 2, please do it. ¿Verdad? Los que no han terminado las áreas de, de, la, de la unidad 2, háganlo. Los que ya lo hicieron, relax, no problem. Ok, so we're going to start with the question, with some of the participations, but um, I will check the attendance list. Ok, voy a revisar la lista de asistencia, please. So please say hello if you're there present. Hi or any word. Ana Mercedes. Present. Thank you, Andrea. Good evening. Good evening, Carmen. Present. Present, Claudia. Present. Carito. Present. Okay. Uh, Christian Alberto, no. Alex. Present. Thank you, Diana. Present. Nice, Diego. Present. Good. Dora. Present. Okay, Edgar, thank you. Present, teacher. Thank you very much. Helen. Present. Nice. Carla. Okay. Present. Thank you. Kevin, no, Kevin not here, right? Leslie, no. Marlon. Present. Thank you. Susie and Veronica. Present. Okay. Present teacher. Good. My opinion is no. It is before everything oh. was cheaper and there were fewer. Okay. Okay. Um alguien se le olvidó desactivar el micrófono. Okay. Question should public transport be free? Why? Why not? Okay, let's listen to some of you. Veronica, you start. Are you ready? 
Yes. Okay, go ahead and after we're having um, Andrea. Yes, yes. Okay. Should public transport be free? Yep. Why will it help the family economy? Um, then the scone has crops. Okay, okay, thank you. Uh, your opinion is focused on the family economy and traffic jams as well. Okay, traffic. Okay, thank you. Um, thank you. And, and less and less contamination. Less pollution. Okay, you say mm -hmm. that maybe pollution. less pollution. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Veronica. Now, Andrea, and then we're having mercy. Um, in some cases, okay. for instance, for the students, for the elderly and disabled people, mm. public transport can not be free because the money paid the users pays the salaries of the people who provide the service. Okay, very accurate. Cuando digo accurate es certera. Ac very accurate because elder, they really need, and of course babies. But even yes. nowadays, uh, the transport, this transportation receives bonus or bonuses. Reciben, verdad? Bonus, they reciben este subsidio. <laughs> and they have the same old buses, right? La misma bus viejo. Okay. Okay, but that's fine. Thank you, Andrea. Merci. And then we're going with Susie. Okay. I think so. There are people scare resources who travel from the far away to get to work every day. Okay. Only. Mm -hmm. Okay. And specific on on especially people who come from from far away. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Nice. And now we're going with Susie and after Claudia. Okay, I think that no, because it is a source of income for many family, for baby. And if it were in terms of the government, for example, not everyone could work there. Mm -hmm. Okay, you, you established uh, some limitations, right? Because the, the money is part of the income of a lot of families. Ah, oh, you mean the drivers, of mm -hmm. course. Mm -hmm. Or the or people who have the, the buses, okay? And Claudia and then Marlo. Okay, my opinion is yes. I think it will help the student special. Mm. That, that that's really important. Student. Uh, there was an initiative like 10 years ago, maybe or I, I don't remember how, how long, but uh, there was a like, uh, there was a proposal, una propuesta. there was a proposal um, and it was about uh, students who wouldn't pay transportation. And uh, I would support that, apoyaría bastante eso. Same as Claudia mentioned, okay. Uh, Marlon, we're going with Marlon and after, uh, uh, I think it should, uh, but we can pay less um, because that money, like my classmate said, is necessary for for uh, the payment of the drivers. I think uh, for for the gasoline or gasoline mm -hmm. gas gasoline, of course, for the oh, gasoline. Oh. Uh, I think uh, that money is necessary. Así es, necessary. 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 Yes. And, uh, but we can pay less. Uh, 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 I think uh, we can uh, or do that. Uh, we can pay less. Uh, if we are paying 20 cents, we can pay the half. And uh, it's like a symbolic. Uh, yeah, portation, yeah, let's say, an apportation. Like a, a, a symbolic apportation, and uh, it, it, it can be uh, like a 
a reason to to change the the, the transportation ways in, in our country disminuyendo uh, teacher uh, la carga vehicular mm -hmm. yeah uh, so to you can you can say decrease 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 mm -hmm. uh, to decrease uh, the, the, yeah the traffic flow mm -hmm. the traffic flow and uh, it can be a uh, 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 and proposing the to use the public uh, transport okay i think uh, it's the better way to go to to our job to any place and uh, aparte de uh, las, las, uh, las formas tecnológicas que uh, bicycles and walking but uh, public transport uh, i think it, it Debería ser explotado, de verdad, y así disminuir, decrease uh, the traffic jam or the yes. traffic flow. And even, I think if we will have a better system of public transportation, we will use it. Nosotros sí lo usaríamos, right? Yeah. But the problem is that it is, it is terrible. Well, we use it, lo usamos, but not, maybe not every day or not every, every people. Yeah. So... Thanks, Marlo. Thanks so much for that opinion. And Carito, and we continue with the class. Okay, Carito. Of course, transportation should be free for students, pregnant women, mm -hmm. the early. In my opinion, uh, the government provide transport of the taxes we pay. Wow, yes, pregnant, yeah. Pregnant girls, pregnant women, of course. That happens and what well, it should be free at least for them okay so thank you Carito. good good point of view now let's continue and then we're going to to, to ask for some other opinions what is to say hasta ahora hasta ahora we can say so far okay there are some phrases that say so far so good hasta ahora todo bien so far so good okay but you can say so far um to, to give an opinion, to establish a point, um, when you say, for example, um, we're not having a good public transportation so far, okay? No hemos tenido un buen transporte público hasta ahora. Until now, the traffic jams have not been solved hasta ahora, ¿verdad? Until now, hasta ahora. Eh, lo, le, los embotellamientos no han, no han podido ser eh, no se han podido resolver up to now up to now uh, the pollution is increasing hasta ahora pues eh, or have been increasing hasta ahora eh, la, la contaminación ha estado como incrementándose Hitler 2 Hitler 2, no Hitler Hitler 2 Hitler 2, eh, you can use it same hasta ahora, cualquiera de las cuatro. But here are two is like more, more formal, como mucho más formal, much more formal. But you can say so far, until now, up to now, no, up, but up to now, here are two. So far, until now, up to now, here are two. So later we're going to make uh, some sentences with this. Ya vamos a hacer un par de, or de oraciones con estas, okay? But I need to, to just pronounce a big one, okay? So far, until now, up to now, here are two. So we start with Andrea, then Carito. Okay, go ahead. Here are two. Thank you, Carito, then Carla. Up to now. Up to now. Okay. Up to now es como hasta ahora en la noche. <laughs> okay, up to now, good. Uh, Carla, then uh, Claudia. Here are two. To Claudia, then Veronica. Until now. Until now. Veronica and Diego. So far. So far. Mm -hmm. Diego and Susie. Until now. Perfect. Susie then Mercy. So far. Nice. Mercy then Marlon. Up to now. Up to now. Okay, good. Uh, we're having Marlon and then Helen. Um, Here are two. Here are two. Helen, Dora. So far. Okay, so far. 
up to now. Up to now, uh, Carmen and Diana. So far. So far, uh, Diana then Edgar. Until now. Until now. Okay, um, Edgar and Alex. So far. So far, okay. Alex, then Christian. Up to now. Up to now, Christian and Kevin. Hello, Christian. Okay, Christian, maybe he's going to connect later. Uh, Kevin, hello. Pronounce one of these ones. Kevin. Hi. Oh, okay. So far, teacher. Sorry. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, um, so here we have some phrases uh, that emphasize uh, a certain idea. For example, uh, there is a there is a phrase. For for example, I really need I really need that memory. Just a moment, please. I need to speak to me, to Mr. Wilson, please. It's very important. Right away. Entonces, como que establecemos esa, we establish that point in which we make like an emphasis that we, it is really urgent, como que es urgente, como que ponete uso, realmente sí importa. So, I really need, really need, I really need that memory. Just a moment, please. I need to speak to Mr. Wilson, please. It's very important right away. Okay, so I will need this uh, dialogue between, I will just select two couples, okay? Veronica and Diego, okay? Diego, you are Mark, Mark Twain. Okay. And Veronica, you're Bill. I really need that memo, Brie. Just a memo, please. I need to speak to Mr. Wilson, please. It's very important. Right away. Okay, nice. Ahora, we are going to listen to Susie. Teacher, and, sorry. Yeah. I have a question. Mm -hmm. What Brie means? Brie is, is the name. It's the name. Like Brenda, like you can say another. Can you see this? Oh, okay. Yes. But it, it sounds like, a, like a, I don't know, like a, another kind of word right but it's a name okay. yes yes i don't know what i'm thinking about thank uh, you I, yeah i maybe i have an idea but okay that's fine okay. <laughs> uh susie and we're having kevin kevin you're mark susie you're brie oh okay i really need that memo brie just a moment please I need to speak to Mr. Wilson, please. It's very important. Right away. Okay, good. Kevin, speak, speak. Okay. Okay. Come on. Speak. speak to me. Okay. Perfect. Okay, thank you. Now we're going, we're having, uh, well, we're having two listenings, but the same paragraph. Vamos a tener dos listening. Bueno, más bien dos audios. Y, um, Ustedes me van a decir qué audio, a qué audio le, le entienden más. Pero realmente uh, son dos personas diciendo, refiriéndose al mismo párrafo. ¿Ok? Escuchen y si gustan pueden anotar. Si no, pues solo escuchan y ustedes me dicen. I'm sorry. I Z E T H. Okay, let's listen. Hey guys, my name is Lisette. L I W S E double T E, but no Lisette. L-I-Z-E-T-H. I work in a restaurant in downtown. Its name is Los Pollos Hermanos. And my boss is Gus Prince. I have worked as a waitress for five years. 
Currently, I'm studying business administration. This is my last year at the university. Next year, I want to become a manager. And in the future, I would like to have my own business. For that reason, I am taking different trainings related to customer service, cooking, and recruitment. In my point of view, everything is possible, but not easy. So I'm working really hard to achieve my goal. Okay, we're going to listen to the second person with the same, the same paragraph. La persona con el mismo paro. Hey guys, my name is Lisette. L-I-S-S-E-T-T-E, -T -T -E, but not Lisette. L-I-Z-E-T-H. I work in a restaurant downtown. Its name is Los Pollos Hermanos. And my boss is Gus Reynolds. I have worked as a waitress for five years. Currently, I'm studying business administration. This is my last year at the university. Next year, I want to become a manager. And in the future, I would like to have my own business. For that reason, I am taking different trainings related to customer service, cooking, recruitment. In my point of view, everything is possible, but not easy. So I'm working really hard to achieve my goal. Okay, uh, tell me what is the, what is the best audio for you? Number one, number two. Number two. The second one. Okay, the second one. Why? Do you think it is uh, like clear or like with pauses or very, or, or better pronounced? Como es pronunciado? Yeah, better pronounced and more clear. Okay, okay. So we're going to, okay. But you tell me what's the paragraph about? What's the description of this person about? Mm -hmm. Let's see. She's talking about her job. He, uh, I remember that she worked from Gus Frings <laughs> yes. and Los Pollos Hermanos. Yes, of course. <laughs> of course, Pollos Hermanos. And I see work. I see. I saw. Breaking Bad Breaking Bad too. too. Yes, yes, wonderful. And even very cool. So it's a very <laughs> yeah. well, it's a it's a it's a ah, yeah. So I recommend you, le recommiendo esa serie, yes. Breaking Bad Perfect. and Very Cool Soul. Yeah. Okay. I saw it too. Yes, so we're waiting for the next uh, season. Definitely. Okay. 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 So well, nice. And yeah. she's in her her last year, uh, I can remember what career, but for the next year, she wants to, to become an, a manager, and I can remember anymore. Okay, okay, thank you, that's fine, that's fine. And uh, you, you, you identified uh, different ideas, so thank you. What about Diana? Okay. Uh, so, hi guys, my name is Lisette. Uh, uh, restaurant Los Pollos Hermanos. Uh, yes, <laughs> yes Pollos uh, boy, Hermanos. And currently business, business administration. Yeah, that's the career, that's the mayor. She's a study. Uh, mm -hmm. Business. Mm, the ultimate question was customer service. Okay, customer service. Okay, thank you. And what about, let's see, Dorita? Um, my boss, my boss is my friend. Next year, my night, my name is Lisette. Customer service. Okay, thank yes, you. Thank you very yes. much. Okay. What about Mercy and then Kevin? 
Uh, I working, my boss, my Navy said, study next. Okay, fine. Kevin and then Andre. Okay, you will escuchar. My name is Lisette. I work in a restaurant. And the last, this is my last year in a university. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the last year. She's studying. Okay, perfect. Uh, we're going to listen to, wow. I think the electricity, it is not working for Okay, now, and it is raining here, well, near, near my house, so the, we, can, uh, we can have some surprises. So, who's next? Who's next? Yo. Yeah. Yo, yeah. me. Me, yeah. Vaya. Good. Yo escuché que ella, eh, she spelled your name. Ah, yeah, she spelled it. Eh, working in a restaurant, eh, escuché que dijo co-worker, eh, customer service, and el, la, el last year of the university. Wow, sure. aunque me gusta que seas creativa y que me pero ya, yeah. most of the words are true, la mayoría son verdad. Tú sí. El number two, porque respeta un poco también más la puntuación. O sea, hace la pausa, es pausado. En cambio, el primero, casi una palabra tras otra, así como hacemos la mayoría de veces. Escuché su nombre, como todos lo han dicho, Seth, quizás fue una de las cosas más claras. Escuché manager, customer service, last year. No sé si fui yo o qué, pero yo escuché people view. People view. Only. Okay, you could say otra cosa por ahí, pero, pero okay. Thank you, Susan. Okay. Every, everything okay at home? Todo bien en casa, right? Sí, sí, sí. <laughs> okay, y esa, it is. Uh, thunder, I can see thunder uh, behind you. Is that, I try not to write all that song. Sí, right. está terrible. Ya se dio cuenta. <laughs> okay, eso es por los pecados. Si yo vemo fuerte por la casa de los pecadores, dice. Okay, thank you. Yes, of course. But the second audio, as you mentioned, it is uh, like it is clear enough. Es suficientemente claro. Gracias, Susan. Okay. Um, Mercy. Um, Alex, Edgar. Mm. Eh, de mi parte, la segunda, la segunda estaba. Me. More clarity is more clarity. Mm -hmm. More eh, entendible, no sé cómo se podría decir en inglés. Sí, under, understandable. Understandable. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Bueno. Okay. Eh, en lo que alcancé a escuchar es, decía el, el nombre, dice, <ríe> alcancé a escuchar. Eh, She got the to last year of university, uh, customer service, and the you, no sé si decía work or, or job is really hard. Yes, really hard. She yeah. said that. Yes, well, they said that. Uh, okay, I'm going to present the, the paragraph so you can see. Yeah, hey guys, my name is Lisette. L I S S E T T E, but not Lizette. L I Z E T H. So she uh, like made emphasis on her name. So people not confused. Porque la gente como no lo confundió. Okay. I work in a restaurant in downtown. His name is Los Hoyos Hermanos, and my boss is God's friends. Uh, he is a really nice guy. Es un sujeto muy agradable. I have worked as waitress for five years. Currently, I'm studying business administration. This is my last year at the university. Next year, I want to become a manager. And in the future, I would like to have my own business. For that reason, I'm taking different trainings. Estoy tomando como diferentes cursos. A eso se refiere. Related to 
y lo que ustedes anotaron, ¿verdad? Customer service, cooking, nobody says cooking, ok, and recruitment. Vamos a preguntarle acá a Dorita, what is recruitment? Do you remember? ¿Te recuerdas? Dorita? No, Carmen, no. Carmen, welcome back. Bienvenida, Carmen. Hi, teacher. Eh, estoy con datos en la okay. casa. No hay wifi. Ok, no problem, no problem. I know. It's... Y no sé de qué están hablando ahorita. No sé ni me interesa, teacher. Okay. No. Ah, thank you, thank you, Carmen. Thank you. Uh, let's listen to Susi. Vaya, Susi, no me decís esto porque. Le veo un café a todos. Sí, con gusto, pero no recuerdo. Marlon, you do remember. Uh, yes, uh, uh, reclutamiento. Yes, it's, it's, well, yes, reclutamiento. Mm -hmm. To hire people. Contratar, uh -huh. Contratar. Contratar. Okay, I'm going to present you again the second audio. Okay. Una pregunta para... Vamos a ver. Mercy, se escucha la lluvia muy fuerte aquí. Uh, a través de mi micrófono. Just a little bit, teacher, but Just a little bit. Okay. okay, thank you, thank you. I was wondering about it. Okay. Audio number two. Hey guys, my name is Lisette. L I S S E T T E, but not Lisette. L-I-Z-E-T-H. I work in a restaurant downtown. Its name is Los Pollos Hermanos. And my boss is Boss Reynolds. I have worked as a waitress for five years. Currently, I'm studying business administration. This is my last year at the university. Next year, I want to become a manager. And in the future, I would like to have my own business. For that reason, I am taking different training related to customer service, cooking, recruitment. In my point of view, everything is possible, but not easy. So I'm working really hard to achieve my goal. Okay. So here we have this paragraph and now uh, we can understand both of them are English teachers. Uh, they are really good, so I constantly I'm, I'm constantly asking for different kind of pronunciations. I have uh, told you before, so you can have uh, another idea how to pronounce. Teacher, casi no se le escucha. No, no se le oye. Creo que es el internet que me está fallando. Está congelado. Está congelado. El internet entonces se me está fallando. Ahora, Carmen, todavía. Sí, estoy congelado. Ya no, teacher. Creo que todos estamos teniendo problemas ahorita con el internet. So, bueno, no es mi culpa, pero. Okay. Um, so, uh, wait. Sí. Se escucha bien lejos. <ríe> Me escucha bien lejos. Ok. Far, far away. Far, far away. Pero estoy hablando cerca, muy cerca. Casi muerto este volado. Take it easy, teacher. I, I think that all of we are having problems with the yes. internet. 
Yes, uh, I, I got the rain. So. It yeah, is right. raining cat and ducks. Right cat and here. ducks. Cat and ducks and demons. Yes. Yes. <laughs> demons. <Yeah. laughs> ¿Quién? ¿Cómo se llama? Está cayendo. ¿Quién da? Bueno, creo que todos tienen problemas excepto Verónica, quizás. Yo no tengo problem. No problem. Yo, yo un poco, sí, Así no se le escucha, Vamos a hacer una actividad, ya te puedo explicar cómo. Mientras se, 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 está, se está... Creo que es en San Salvador el problema. I think so. Yo creo que así es. Ya les envío este, las indicaciones. Permítanme. Ok. Kevin, ¿ahora puedes escucharme? ¿Te escucha igual? Sí, se escucha mejor. Muy bien. Bien, esperamos que es, eh, no nos falle tanto esta señal. Vamos a hacer lo siguiente. Vamos a trabajar en... Bueno, en pareja está tan difícil, así que lo vamos a hacer individual, porque el internet está demasiado lento para trabajar en pareja. Así que vamos a leer este correo electrónico y vamos a organizar las actividades del Guadalupe. This is like a, a mail um, to Guadalupe and related to activities uh, she has to do. ¿Verdad? Relacionada a las actividades que tiene que hacer ella. She needs to do by importance. Ella tiene que hacer esas actividades por orden de importancia. Así que necesito que la leamos, tomémonos unos tres minutos, leámosla y este, necesito que anoten acá primera, segunda, tercera y cuarta actividad que se debe de hacer por importancia. ¿okay? Porque esa es la, eh, digamos, la actividad en sí. Que nosotros leamos, es una actividad de reading, cosa que casi nunca tenemos esta actividad, pero ahora pues, vamos a aprovechar. Saquemos las cuatro actividades, take notes, tomen notas. Okay. Ya le voy a consultar en alrededor de 3, 4 minutos lo consulto. Teacher, sorry. And... Yeah, tell me. Okay. And it is in the, in the manual, this paragraph. Yes, 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 yes. You can okay. see. Um, Which page it is? I want to show you. Sí. Mm -hmm. It's on page 25. 25. Oh, okay, okay. Yes. Thank you, teacher. Yes, you Got can it. do it. Page 25. Okay. It is very easy. Exercise 5. Page 25. Si tienen el manual, pueden verlo ahí. Sí.
teacher. ¿Quiere que pueda seguir compartiendo la, el párrafo? El párrafo, ah, párrafo por, perdón, por favor. Ok, ok. En un momento, I'm sorry. Yeah. Here we have it. Okay, I think we have like a clear idea about uh, this paragraph and the main ideas. And also I will need you to help me read it, okay? So we're going to start with Mercy. Okay, Mercy, please, I need you to read. Meanwhile, the rest are, are finishing. Vamos, dear Guadalupe, you're going to read from here until here, okay? I really need you to con que le lea, verdad, teacher? Yes, yes. Dear Guadalupe, these are some of the tasks for this mom. I really need to to contact the first three potential customer in the list from Mr. San Sanchez. You have three days to do it. Three hours each day. Each day, yes, thank Each you. Each day. Thank you, thank you, Mercy. Customers, okay, customers. 
perfect. Okay, now we're going to continue with um, Veronica. Uh, from here to here, from call to day. Go ahead, Veronica. Call the new clients. Clients. Clients, mm -hmm. clients from the last three weekends and give them the catalog information for June. You have two days to do it, one hour each day. Yes, one hour each day, okay. Thank you very much. We're having, Kevin, please help me. It's very, until, until four hours, okay. It's very important. It's very important to send the, to? The two latest, latest sales. Sale. Report on May 26th, and the write a new welcome letter from the new customer. You have one day to do it, four hours. Okay, thank you very much. Now we're going to have Helen. Helen, please help me. Are you there, Helen? Finally, visit. Finally, visit the two store in Santa Tecla. You have two day. Two ips, two horse, eight die. Mm -hmm. Organize your weekend. Okay, excellent. Good. So um, we have thank you. Best regards. Cuando decimos best regards, siempre decimos los mejores deseos. Daniel Riz, who is uh, Guadalupe's boss. Okay. So obviously, we have the thing uh, that we consider that the most important, something that uh, that has to be done the same day, okay? And do we have that one? Ya tenemos esa, la que tiene que ser right now. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, which one? ¿Cuál es? Send the two late sales reports on May 26th and the right annual welcome letter for the new. Yes. For ¿Cuánto one tiempo día. tenemos? How much time? One, one, one día, day, one day. One day, well, the same thing, four hours, even half a day, ¿verdad? La mitad del día, okay, fine. Um, what about number two? Diego, do, are you ready with that one? Yes, I am, teacher. Okay, uh, please, go ahead. The second one is visit the two stores in Santa Tecla. Okay, uh -huh. visit. Uh, how much time does Guadalupe has to do it? Um, she has two days to do it and two hours each day. Yeah, so so it is not so urgent, right? Okay, but uh, it is, well, it has to be done in two days. Thank you. Okay, what about Andrea? Do you have number three, Andrea? Mm, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, yo había puesto visit the Esa la que dijo Diego, yo la había puesto en el número tres. Okay, we have, uh, there are two, there are like quite similar. Hay dos que son bien parecidas, okay? So the other, ¿y cuál habías puesto en el número dos? Eh, need contact the first three potential customers. Mm -hmm. Esa. Customers in the list from Mr. Sanchez, you have three days to do it. Three okay. hours. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay, pero aquí tenemos three days to do it. Y aquí tenemos uh -huh. two days to do it. So, so this it's is nice. like more important. Mm -hmm. okay. es, es cierto. Es, es, yo es, la segunda había puesto al de mi client. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes. The, the, the second one is called the client. Because uh, Guadalupe has two days. And for the other two days, but in this one, she has one hour, right? In this one, she has two hours. Yes, Diana. So could you say that, Diana, please call the new clients? Call the new clients in the last three weeks and give them the catalog, catalog information. information. Catalog information. Yes, them. yes. So this one is the second. And this one is the third one. So the number four, obviously, what about Carmen? Do you have it? I really need you to contact the first three potential customer in the list from Mrs. Mr. Sanchez. Okay, thank you. How much time does Guadalupe has to do it? Three days, 
Yes. Y uh, three hours. Yes. Entonces, se puede relajar ni puede ir a trabajar si quiere. Okay. Thank you very much. We go, uh, we go now on to uh, the same um, topic. I'm sorry. Should public transport be free? We're going to continue with this. Thank you for, for all your, your, your opinions and participations. And what about if we listen to Diana? Are you ready, Diana? Okay. Please. Right. And then Alex. In my opinion, it should be free for children, elderly. Okay, creo que se te quedó risen the image, te congelaste, Diana. Okay. Mm, bien, ya tenemos la oportunidad. Diana, hello. Sí, estoy, pero creo que no me escuché. Ajá, for, for children and elderly, right? Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, Students and disabled people and that it should be a mm. one time free for all. Wow, yes, yes. Good point, thank you. Okay, Alex, and after Alex, we're having uh, Chris. Um, no, okay, Alex, and then we're having Carmen. I think, I think on the people why disabilities. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, for those one, okay. Thank you. Excellent. Okay, uh, we go with Carmen and then Dora. In my opinion, no, the public transportation should to be free, but I think it should be provided by the state with rational cost, security, and established schedules. Yes, definitely, yes, security. We need security in the public transportation and established schedules. Okay, yes, Carmen. You for president, Carmen for president. What for her? Nice, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, she's going to hire all of you. A todos va a contratar this. Okay, nice, Carmen. Okay, then we go with Dorita, right? Dorita and after Helen. I think no, because if buying there is bad service, if it is free, it will be worse. <laughs> if it is free, it will be worse. Sería peor, dice. Okay, Dorita, thank you for your honesty. Yeah, yes, why not? Thank you. Helen and then Kevin. My opinion is could be for people um, with low resources and green, they eat free transport. Okay, yes, with low resources. Thank you. Okay, we're going with Kevin and then Edgar. I think so because of the people who need to travel to work every day and live far away. Okay, good point. Yes, another vote for people who live far away. Okay, Edgar and then Carla. Uh, in, in my opinion is yes for free uh, because uh, the same word says is public. It should be free for all for the good of the economy of families and people with economy, the economic difficulties. Okay, it will help for people's economy. Thank you. Carla, and then Christian. Um, yes, because there um, all tax will be financed and it will help the most near people a lot. Mm. Okay, thank you. Okay, Christian and then Diego. My teacher, Hello. Uh, sería, uh, no, not free, 
uh, what safer and more orderly. Okay, thank you, thank you. We need, yes, we need security, it should be safe. Okay, thank you. And Diego, tell me, my friend, what's your opinion about hey, it? Yeah. Why not? The government should subsidize the transportation entrepreneurs. Uh, with the objective of that way, all users can get a little but important saving of money. Besides, they should to invest in better transport units in order to guarantee safe, saving every travel for everyone. Yeah, because um, so far, we're not having good uh, means of transportation, right? Yes, they have to invest because the current um, administration, because it, it is private, uh, they are not taking into account to invest more. They're just taking all the money from, from the government or the money that from the from the buses and all those things. So that's why even there are some buses in that they are about to to break down the some for 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 quedarse for arruinarse mm -hmm. and that's my point there there have been mm -hmm. uh, some accidents terrible accidents because of that yeah okay thank you thank you very much for all your opinions now i need you to take a look at this conversation i'm going to give you five seconds a kevin le voy a preguntar primero Okay, so five seconds. And then Elgar. Okay, Kevin, you go first, my friend. Then Elgar. Okay, is something you need to do tomorrow? I was see. Okay, yes, it's something you need to do. Okay, Edgar, and then Carla. Uh, I'm going to leer, I, I need to call clients. Mm. Perfect, I need to call clients. Okay, Carla, then Helen. Uh, something. Ah, something, yes, something. something. Okay, uh, Helen, where are you? And then Claudia. New todo. Okay, Claudia, then Carito. Me recuerdo de playa, improviso. Ok. Hoy. Thank you. Only. Me gusta que sean creativas. Thank you, Claudia. <laughs> ok. Carito de Indiana. I have to provide. Pro, provide. 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 Okay, provide. <laughs> Good. Diana. Uh, but. Too bad. Too bad. So bad. Thank you, Denita. And John, John Wick, and Anne. Okay. So here I have two. And Marlon is going to help me with John. And Andrea is going to help me with Anne. Okay. Go ahead, <coughs> please. Anne, is there something you need to do tomorrow? Yes, actually, I need to call some clients. And you? Well, I have to reschedule uh, two meetings for tomorrow. They were canceled today. Oh, that's that's too bad. Yes, I have to provide important information to some customers. That sounds interesting. Okay, good, perfect, perfect. So we're going to do an activity right now. Vamos a hacer una actividad diferente. Um, you're going to be in couples. Okay, van a estar en, en, en parejas. And I need you to restructure this conversation. So you need to change it with your personal um, routine or personal obligation that you have at work. I mean, uh, let's imagine here we have Kevin and Diana. So Kevin says, Diana, is there something you need to do tomorrow? And Diana is going to say, yes, actually, I need to. ¿Qué tendría que hacer mañana, Diana? 
Yes, check absolutely. the inventory. Check the inventory and you, okay? And then Kevin will say, Kevin diría, Kevin, well, I have two. Okay, Kevin, ¿qué tiene que hacer mañana? Kiss the girl, okay, or what? Okay. Um, send emails, for example, okay? So you can change it, pueden cambiarlo, okay? Another, another, another example. Uh, Carmen says, um, oh, puede ser, that's too bad, or that's good, or that's horrible. Pueden, pueden cambiarlo como ustedes quieran. Even, even you can increase the, the conversation. And Diego would say, yes, digamos que si es algo negativo, algo como que Diego doesn't want to do it, but uh, he has to. So, yes, I have two, Diego. I have to make a lot of calls, important make calls. Important calls, okay. As much as I can, right? As much as you can. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And Carmen would say, Mm, that sounds interesting. Oh, that sounds hard. Eso suena como pesado. Suena, oh, that sounds interesting. Suena interesante. Oh, that sounds important. Oh, suena como importante. Okay. So, I need you to change this conversation. Okay. And to have it like uh, adapted for you. Quiero que la adapten o sea, que le cambien. Si ustedes quieren, le pueden cambiar poquitas frases o le pueden cambiar más frases, ¿ok? It's up to you. Todos van a participar en eso, ¿ok? So I need to hear all of your conversation. Necesito escuchar todas sus conversaciones, ¿ok? So please, uh, if you have the manual, uh, go to the next page, page 26, um, exercise number two. But if not, you can have a screenshot. Pueden tener una captura de pantalla, ¿ok? Um, questions, hay preguntas. Lo que les estoy pidiendo es que um, van a cambiar ciertas palabras. Por ejemplo, no van a decir and, ¿verdad? Sino que van a decir nombre. En lugar de decir I need to, uh, I need to call some clients. Bueno, en el caso de Diego tal vez, ¿verdad? Pero en el caso de otros, eh, ustedes no tienen que llamar clientes. Por ejemplo, Helen creo que no tiene que llamar clientes. Tampoco, no sé si Susi. ¿verdad? Entonces, en ustedes pueden cambiarle, eh, check the inventory, uh, order the product, uh, talk to my boss, hablar con mi jefe, ¿ok? Pueden utilizar, um, pueden utilizar diferentes frases, ¿ok? Aquí vamos a utilizar cosas que ustedes van a hacer mañana, ¿ok? So, that's the una consulta. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué significa reschedule? Reschedule, va. Eh, ¿Se recuerda que es schedule? Sí, es como, como agenda. Yes, agendar también es un verbo. Uh -huh. Es un es agenda y agendar. So reschedule es como agendar de nuevo, ¿verdad? Cambiarle eso. eso. So yeah, you don't have to do it. No tiene que ser todo eso, ¿verdad? Simplemente usted solo puede cambiar. Well, I have to to attend customers. Bien, tengo que atender clientes, ¿ok? Y ustedes le pueden cambiar acá. ¿verdad? Depends on your creativity. De hecho, esta ya es una base para que ustedes hagan su conversación. Incluso ustedes ya están listos para hacer cosas que vamos a hacer la otra semana. Ustedes van a crear una conversación, ¿verdad? Eso más es interesting. Pero basado en eso, le pueden cambiar. Ok. More questions? ¿Hay preguntas? No questions? Ok. Bien. Andreita está con todos los poderes. Ya le Me llega Andreita. Ok, I'm going to form the, the, the first. Voy a formar la, las parejas. Give me a second. And si quieren, I recommend you to have a list of three things you have to do tomorrow. Haga una lista de tres cosas que tienen que hacer mañana para que cuando ya estén con su compañero o compañera, with your classmate, eh, that is going to be easier. Va a ser más fácil hacer la, la, esa conversación. Haga una lista de tres cositas. Ok.
Um, sería... Uh -huh. yo, porque yo estoy preparándome como Anne. Uh -huh. Entonces usted se prepara como yo. Uh -huh. sí. Ok, hello girls, everything ok, todo bien? Sí. Yes, ok, excelente. Sí. Mm, I need to check email of my boss, for example. Sí, podría ser también. Okay, I need to send to check. Sorry, email of my boss. Thank you. Thank you. ¿Qué podría poner? Quiero ver. Mm. Bueno, podría ser como... Ok, girls, eh, tengo una recomendación. ¿Alguien de ustedes si ya tiene lista, eh, tiene la, la captura? Puede compartirla, si quieren, para que no se pierdan. ¿Saben, eh, ¿saben cómo compartir pantalla? Es que yo lo tengo en el otro teléfono, Ticha. Mm, ya, no, yo decía porque si ustedes hacen esto, por ejemplo, ¿verdad? si van a compartir así, usted, uno de ustedes dos puede hacer esto y van viendo aquí una por una, ¿verdad? porque es más fácil para que se guíen, ¿sí me entienden? Uh -huh. Si gustan y si no pueden seguir así, pues una sugerencia. Uh -huh. ¿no? uh -huh. Uh -huh. Gracias. Ok, okay girls. Gracias. You're welcome. No, puede, puede decir, yes, yo yes que... have important es review a Congress Bible. Uh, that sounds important or oh, that sounds interesting. Thank you. Uh -huh. Repetimos, repetimos esa parte. Hello guys. Are you, are you, are you finished? Yes. Um, yes, pero si quiere reprise. No, no, dele, dele. I, I'm checking, solo estoy revisando about how fast. You, okay. You're really fast, son rápido, me llega. Bueno, después lo veo.
Yo le voy a contestar. Well, I check the inventory in the morning. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Check. Well, no, well, no. No. Oh, that's, that's great. Uh-huh, that's great. Okay. And... Tú me dirías otra. Otra actividad, uh -huh. Sí. Yes, I... I check cell. And... For the state. For the state. Sí, este es tienda, ¿verdad? Eh, storage. 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 Uh -huh. I storage. Y entonces yo voy a decir. That's very hard. No. Ah, al final ok that sound interesting ok jugar la ropa me dijo verdad sí. I have to wash clothes I have to wash wash clothes C L U Clote. ajá Hmm. Ok. Sería la tercera. Sí. Ok. How are you doing? ¿Cómo van? ¿Finish? Uh, sí, casi terminamos. Esa cara me llega. Ajá, sí. Ok, ya casi, ya casi. Sí, ya casi, ya casi. Uh -huh. Nice. Porque ahí quiere decir que tengo que proporcionar una información importante a... Espera, son fonts, no me acuerdo. Hola, hello, dice ¿cómo va? Dice que tiene que proporcionar, hello, teacher. Todo bien, <risa> teacher. Sí, eh, todo bien. Excelente, excelente. Eso, that's fine. Thank, Thank you, you, teacher. Okay, you're welcome. Sí, dice que, ven la siguiente, dice. Pro, pro. Provide important provide. information to some customers. To some customers. Me es lo mismo que, que escribir information to some client. Hello guys, how are you doing? Uh, you're I'm done? Just are you done? Teacher. Almost. Yes. Okay. Okay. Oh, you're ready. Mm, a little bit. But do you want... They want to hear us? Okay, go ahead. Because we, okay, okay. we need to get, give the, some other teams a little bit, uh, <laughs> a while, okay? Okay, then, and we're done. If you want, continue okay. with, with the other activity. No, 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 go ahead. I want to hear you. Okay, okay. Uh, Dora, is there something you need to do tomorrow? Yes, actuality, actually, I need to write Report and send letter. And you? Okay. Well, I have to reschedule some calls. I tried to contact these clients before and I didn't talk with them because they're just going to talk at 6 p.m. Oh, thanks to bad. Yes, and I have to, to make some payment agreements tomorrow too. That sounds interesting. Okay, okay. Okay, that's fine. Solo un detalle, Dorita. That sounds, sounds. That sounds. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Sounds. Interesting. Uh -huh. Sounds. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. 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 Así, hasta moviéndote como que quieres bailar. Yes. Okay. Very good <laughs> job, guys. Very good job. I like your conversation. Okay, sure. Okay, see you in a moment. Okay, see you in a while.
Hey, Diego, one question. What's, I'm um, sorry, what's your occupation? I don't remember. I'm a recovery agent. Ah, really? Um, yeah. Do you work for, uh, well, I, I don't know the enterprise you work for. Yeah, currently I working from Digicel. Mm -hmm. Okay. I got a people who, who they have some money for the company and, and I call them. Okay. <laughs> so I, yeah. I think <laughs> you, you have like uh, some special clients, right? Yes. Are there some special ones? I can stand with yes, some of them. It is difficult. It is not easy. What you, uh, I can imagine that you're really patient. Yes, sometimes you in the, the in contrast. You, to say you, you come across or, or you, yeah, you face mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, a lot of things. Like, well, uh, talk. Talk, talk. Talk yeah. with, with, with people that, that aren't really rude. And actually, most of the clients have like some disorders on their DS. <laughs> And well, that happens. <laughs> yes, because I have been, well, I have worked in, in customer service. It is not easy at all. So, no, no, so I, I, admire, I admire people who worked on that, in that area. So, congratulations. This is the reason why I, I'm looking for, for yes. other jobs. Definitely, you will get it, my friend. Remember my words, you will get it. <laughs> okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, do you think that life is better now than 50 years ago, Susie? Do you think the life is better now, now better than in the past? Uh, in my opinion, uh, um, advantage of life today is advanced technology. And it is good because it has helped, helped, helped sorry, in many important areas, like the medicine. By the way, it have also used it for improper thing, but it is because of the mentally and values of many people today. Hmm. Yeah, well, I like your points, but however, nevertheless, <laughs> Um, by the way, <laughs> by the way, in fact, do you think it is better now or in the past? Because you, you established uh, different uh, ideas and I like them, of course. But at the end, better now or in the past? I know it is uh, difficult. Maybe, I know, maybe, I know. Maybe no, maybe no. Maybe, maybe now. Okay, maybe. Okay, maybe not. Yeah, but, but you just you, you said medicine. Of course, it is medicine. Yeah, yeah, one of the best advantages. Okay, let's listen to Andreita because she wants to share a lot of ideas. And they will go in with Carla. Um, but yeah. Yes, but yeah, be but yeah. because before there, there was not overpopulation. The foods were not gen genetically uh, altered everything. Everything was no more natural. There was not so much violence. There was not so much uh, contamination. Teacher? Well, pollution. Yeah, pollution. contamination, pollution. On the other hand, before there were not all the technological advan advances that we have now. We have now, yes. When, the, when you said that, uh, uh, genetically altered. I remember one one of one father at at my school, padre familia. He used to he used to think, or maybe uh, well, currently he he thinks in that way that uh, his son uh, had like different attitudes, and he thought his son was becoming gay because he liked a lot of pollo campero. Entonces el papá pensaba que porque su hijo comía mucho pollo campero, 
su hijo se estaba volviendo un poquito extraño, ¿verdad? Entonces, eso, different ideas, but uh, what I, I say is that, uh, yes, uh, there are a lot of things, well, a lot of food, especially that we consume that they're uh, genetically altered, but <laughs> a different idea. So, thank you, Andreita. But Teacher, mm -hmm. es que a mí me faltó uh, the first point, it was yes and no. Entonces, yo solo puse in my opinion, pero era sí y no. O sea, lo primerito que tenía que responder era sí y no, pero lo pasé por alto, sorry. Ok, ok. So, you are 50-50. 50-50 estás entonces. 50-50. Yep. Mm -hmm. yep. Bueno, ok. Como que si te divorcias o seguí con tu matrimonio. Ok, thank you, Susi. Ok, hey, thank you, Susi. Andrea, and we go with um, Carla. And after Carla, we're having Marlon. And yes, because before there was the screaming and it was suffer and we had a healthier life. Okay. Mm -hmm. So in the past, no, not too much crime and a healthier life. Vida más saludable. Okay, good points, Carla. Marlon, and then we're going with Helen. Uh, uh, I think, teacher, um, that's, a, a, that's a relative topic. Mm -hmm. uh, we have advantage and disadvantage of, of every, uh, every time. Yeah. But, but we can say uh, some great advantage in 50 years ago is that they were no pandemic. Así se dice pandemia. Mm -hmm. They were no pandemic. They were no no much crimes like today. They were no gangs like today. Uh, maybe they they have uh, different gangs, but uh, but not like today. So I think uh, we we uh, or the people. Uh, could walk uh, more free in, in the ways, in, in, in all the places, uh, more free than today. Uh, okay. I think that, that are some advantage uh, of the time 50 years ago, but we have more technologies, we have more investigation uh, uh, and Ah, research, yeah, research, more investigation, research and development. Uh, I think we we are uh, we are uh, we have we advanced. Are, mm -hmm. We have advanced. We have advanced in or improved. Yeah, or improved in uh, different aspects. Okay, in different aspects as fifty years ago, and like the ways of transportation too. Like I said before, in not, in another topic, and I think it's relative, and we have advantage and disadvantage in. Every time. So you're 50 50. Yeah, I am 50 50. Okay, nice. Just one, one detail advantages is plural. Advantages. And disadvantages. Mm -hmm. uh, plural. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you, Marlon. Yes, yes, good, good points. Very nice, as always, Marlon. And Helen, right? Se me está escondiendo, Helen. Nice. Hello there. <laughs> Helen, <laughs> and then Mercy. And uh, why a lot of the lincens? No sé, delincuencia, no sé cómo se dice. Crime, yeah, delinquence, crime. Um, ethical values, eh, valores. They okay. have lost to die life is very hasty. Only. Okay, thank you. Very nice. Okay, values. You, you mentioned values. That is something that in the past generation, they were like, uh, they have a strong base. Tenían una base como bastante sólida, bien, bien. In fortalecida in nowadays is kind of you can see a lot of parents that they don't rise in the correct way to the child the, to the kids no crean bien a los niños porque se vuelven muy well they there's no discipline as well no hay mucha disciplina thank you Helen so are you 50 50 igual 50 50 igual entre sí y no okay pero yo siento que más 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 a los a los 50 años okay thank you and who, who else who else mercy and we finish with Veronica. My opinion, yes. 
Now there are more job opportunities, technology, free education, entrepreneurship programs. Entrepreneurship, yes. And now we have more businesses even. They can be like a short or small businesses, but we have more now because of the population. <laughs> and that's a disadvantage, okay? Uh, Veronica. What of often? Mm -hmm. um, because today there are more study opportunities and before because there are more ills and before there was less crime. Um, less crime, muy bien. Utilizo less que es menos, less crime. Okay, fine. We're going to continue with the others, okay? Uh, because we have, the, hello, Diego, tell me, my friend. Uh, sorry, teacher. I just, I just want to say to you that I I didn't participate yet, oh. but we are not fit. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, with this one or yes, with the with previous? No, okay. with this one. Okay, Diego, go ahead. Okay, Are you 50-50, 60-40? Okay. What about it? Hmm? Mm, I'm not sure about it. Let's hear that. Of course, that it is uh, 50 years ago, there weren't all these advances in technology gadgets like smartphones, tablets, Chromebooks. Those who, whether they want to or not, make our lives simple and easier. But on the other hand, currently we have other problems, for instance, overpopulation, more pollution, an important decrease of natural resources. And that one is not so cool. And pollution is affecting even our nutrition. And with it, our quality of life is getting worse every day. So, now I'm not sure that our lives are better than 50 years ago. We have advances, but maybe our life quality, it is not that good, right? I mean- no, it's in decrease every day. Mm -hmm. And even 50 years ago, people could grow old or maybe they didn't die as young as now no morían tan jóvenes como ahora, <laughs> right? Like, uh, yeah, life expectations, la esperanza de vida, ¿verdad? O la expectativa de vida, they were like longer. Okay, uh, our grandfathers, nuestros abuelos, can you imagine? Maybe we're not, uh, not going to reach to 80s, ya no vamos a alcanzar los 80. Mm -hmm. Maybe not. <laughs> okay, we, I hope so. Espero ver los viejitos, but I don't know. Maybe it's, it's a possibility. So you're 50, 50 or mm, not so sure? Yeah, I'm 50, 50. 50, 50 as well. Okay. Okay, fine, fine. Yeah, of course. Y ni sé si vamos a llegar también. Okay, uh, we're having the first couple, well, the first pair, Dianita, va a comenzar con todos los poderes, with horse powers. <laughs> okay, okay, then. Okay. The conversation. Ah, okay. We have nine minutes. I am not sure if we're going to finish this, okay? <laughs> Neither conversation nor the question, but nine minutes. Vamos a ver en qué avanzamos con nine minutes. Si no, seguimos mañana. Okay, Danita, go ahead with the conversation. Okay. Era mi compañera Helen. Go ahead, please. Okay, Helen, is there something you need to do tomorrow? Ya me tiene que contestar y ya no entiendo. Yes, 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 sí, lo tiene que contestar. Vamos. I need to check my email. Uh, well, I have a meeting I, at my son's school. I have a meeting. I breakfast for Thursday. And you? Hmm. I have to apply the second dose, dose of the vaccine. 
Oh, mm. very good. I have import information about promotion. Uh, that sounds interesting. Okay, thank you. Thank you to both of you. Very good. Uh, nice. Now we go with Carmen. Okay, Carmen. Carmen, sit up. Who is your partner? Carmen. Okay. Eh, es Caro. Okay, Caro line. Go ahead. Okay. Is there something you need to do tomorrow? Actuality, I check the inventory in the morning. And you? I need to organize an event. Oh, that's good. Yes, also I, I have to look for some donation. That could be great. Mm, very good, Secretary of Florida. Fine, excellent. Uh, Kevin, are you ready, Kevin? Yes, teacher. Okay, go ahead, my friend. Okay. Andrea, is there something you need to do tomorrow? Yes, actually, I need to check inventory. And you? Well, I have to order the product because I didn't have time now. Um, oh, that's, that's too good. Yes, tomorrow I have more time for ordering the product. Oh, you will have a very busy day. Excellent. Creative, muy creativo. Okay, thank you very much. Excellent. Okay. Uh, Alex, are you there? ¿Estás listo, Alex? Okay, si no está listo, no vamos. No, a... no, dicho. No. Okay, no yet. Okay. Ah, no, 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 no. Bueno, tú lo pudiste. Okay, uh, Alex, uh, we have the 10 minute session. Tenemos la sesión de 10 minutos, okay? Yes. Después, Edgar, are you ready, Edgar? Yes, teacher. Okay, go ahead, please. Empecemos. Uh, uh, Susana, there is something do you need to, to do tomorrow? Yes, of course. I need to check email of my boss. And you? Well, I love products on the system all day. It's boring and tired. Oh, that's terrible for you. Yes, I have to check. I have to check bosses with medicine before sense. Oh, it's excellent. Well seen. Perfect. I like that you used uh, different words. That sounds perfect. So, no, muy bien. Okay. And um, uh, Christian, are you ready, Christian? Yes, I am I ready. Please, my friend, go ahead. Oh, mercy, me tocó. Mercy. Okay. Eh, mercy, is there something you need to do tomorrow? Yes, actually, I need to print purchase orders. And you? Well, I have two, two clients for tomorrow. And they were last week. Oh, that's too bad. Yes, I have to provide import information, uh, information, uh, the new product, a uh, new price. That sounds interesting. Okay, thank you. Excellent. Well said. Solo dos cositas. Interesting. Merci. Okay, interesting. Y Christian, information. Okay, information. Thank you. Very good. Okay, um, Dorita, ready? Diego, is there some something you need to do tomorrow? Yes, I do, but what a minute, please. <laughs> okay. Yes, I need to sell some emails first time in the morning to confirm my client's pay. Well. I have to write letter and send report. Ah, that's terrible. Yes, I have to check email. Okay, cool. Hmm. Okay, fine, fine, excellent. Thank you very much. Uh, Veronica, are you ready? Ready. Okay, go ahead with Carla. Marlon, 
Uh, Marlon, sorry, Marlon. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Marlon, is there something you need to do tomorrow? Uh, yes, actually, I have to bring some uh, production orders. And you? Well, I have to elaborate checks the supplier. Oh, that sounds good. Yes, I have our folders as a Bible and, and review a cover as a Bible. Uh, okay, it sounds uh, interesting. Thank okay, thank you very much. Thanks, thanks. Good. Parece que hay bastante movimiento ahí. Está viendo la novela, Marlon. Ah, oye, Marlon, está poniendo el dedo. Ok, eh, go, Claudia, ah, no, dice, va, para nada, no te dan Claudia, ok, este es el último, con Carla, please. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Eh, Carla, comienza. Ok, go ahead, Carla, please, tenemos yeah. un minuto, yes, go okay. ahead. Claudia, is there something, something you need to do tomorrow? Yes, actually. I have to update the list with the names of the new employees and you? Well, I have to do an inventory for him tomorrow. Oh, that's too bad for you. If he has important information for the bus. That sound very important. Okay, good. Important. 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 Yeah, thank you. Okay, uh, I think we have 30 seconds. Creo que tenemos con 30 segundos. Move to check the attendance list and we finish. Para los que no pasaron ahora con la pregunta de si ahora es mejor que hace 50 años, mañana. Okay, mañana pasa. Okay. Eh, Ana Mercedes. Present. Good. Andrea. I'm here. Thank you, Carmen. Present. Good. Eh, Claudia. Present. Carito, thank you. It's me. Good. It's you, Christian. Present. Nice. Alex. Present. Diana. Present. Good. Diego. I'm living. Good. <laughs> Dora. Present. Nice. Edgar. Yeah. Present, teacher. Good. Thank you. Helen. Present. Fine. Carla. Present. Good. Kevin. Present. Nice. Marlon. Present. Good. Susie. Present. And Veronica. Present, teacher. Okay, my friend. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Hagan las tareas. Do the homework. Good night. Teacher, solo una cosa. En, en esta unidad es que íbamos a hacer el midterm, ¿verdad? Yes. Le voy a escribir. ¿Verdad? Bye. Para que lo puedan hacer. Ay, Andreita, esa carita. Esa cara es de culpable. Vaya. Vaya. Adiós. Sí. Buenas noches. Esa carita me llega. Bye. Ok, eh, Alex, dime, tenemos Hola. un. Uh -huh. Ok, tenemos 10 minutos. Dime, eh, ¿hay un tema que te gustaría que te explicara nuevamente, que hiciéramos un refuerzo o que tú consideras que está un poquito complicado o confuso? Eh, eh, ya le digo, ahorita que lo, creo que lo marqué, lo que uh -huh. estaba interesado. Sí, sí. En... En, lo de, en el tema de Do you mean? Ah, va, esa es la de ayer. Permití. Ok. Sí, ese tema estuvo un poquito. Como que medio confuso. Ok. Va, utilizamos Do you mind? En el caso de que nosotros queremos preguntarle a alguien, mmm, por decirlo así, utilizamos de para pedirle amablemente a una persona 
que haga o que no haga algo en específico. Por ejemplo, cuando decimos minus, te importa, te molesta. ¿Te molesta cerrar la puerta? ¿Te molesta hablar más fuerte? ¿Te importa hablar más fuerte? Ya. Entonces, es para eso. Entonces, por aquí está, do you mind? Se utiliza el do you mind y el verbo con ing. ¿Ya ves? No es close, sino closing. No es speak, sino speaking. ¿Ok? Por eso tenemos que mind es igual a bother. No brother. Bother. Y bother significa molestar. Uh -huh. Por eso que te dice, te molestaría, ¿verdad? Te molestaría o te molesta hacer la, la puerta. Te molestaría hablar más fuerte. Digamos que si habla, eh, tú estás hablando con alguien, pero sí. se escucha muy suave. Entonces, I'm sorry, do you mind speaking aloud, please? ¿Verdad? ¿Te importaría hablar más fuerte? Entonces, esta persona va a hablar más fuerte porque ya se lo pediste. ¿Ya? Porque si, vos le, si tú le dices, hey, habla más fuerte, se escucha muy, muy pesado. Oh. Ajá, se escucha como que ordenando. Y te dice, bueno, igual, ¿por qué me estás ordenando? <risa> ya. Ok. Eh, hay dos formas para decirlo. De esta manera, do you mind? Y el verbo con ing, do you mind closing the door? Do you mind speaking aloud? O puedes utilizar también este, la otra forma, que es esta. Do you mind if? Si utilizamos el if, significa te importaría si yo cierro la ventana, digamos que está haciendo frío. Entonces, este, tú te estás congelando y le decís a alguien, mm, te molesta si cierro la ventana. Ah, y la persona, no, hombre, dale, te voy a decir. Ok. Eh, digamos que tú estás ansioso. No sé si tú fumas, pero en caso que alguien fume, eh, si está muy ansioso y, y, o nervioso o estresado, te puede decir, ah, te molesta si yo fumo acá. Y si te molesta, I'm sorry, I don't like smoke. Lo siento, no me gusta el, el humo. Entonces, esta persona no lo va a decir. Pero, pero te puede decir, pero si no es no, dale, son un poquito alejados. Ok, go ahead, just stay away. Solo quédate un poquito lejos. Do you mind if I sit here? Y esto se utiliza, eh, 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 ¿te molestaría si me siento aquí? ¿Te importaría si me siento aquí? Esto es especialmente cuando vas, por ejemplo, a, a un lugar y tienes que sentar, ves un asiento vacío ¿verdad? y te vas sí. a sentar en, normalmente uno dice está ocupado ajá, está ocupado ajá, eso preguntamos, pero en inglés no se dice, do you mind if I sit here? ¿verdad? entonces pues ahí la persona dice no, go ahead, adelante o te, la gente te va a decir, ok, no problem ¿verdad? bien y está la otra que es, do you mind if I leave earlier? Te molesta, va, digamos que tú estás en una fiesta y te sientes incómodo y no encontras fácil ni nada, te quieres decir. Entonces le puedes decir al anfitrión, al dueño de la, de la, de la casa, um, no hay nada si me voy, ¿verdad? Esa es la pregunta, ¿verdad? No hay problema. Entonces, sí. ¿do you mind if I leave earlier? ¿Te portaría así? ¿Me voy temprano? Y la persona te puede decir, ok, no puedo, igual, ¿verdad? Entonces, hay dos maneras. Utilizamos el do you mind con el verbo in ing. O podemos utilizar el do you mind if, con el if, ¿ya? Do you yeah, mind yeah. if, uh -huh, ya. Yeah. Ahora, tenemos eh, cómo vamos a contestar para eso. Podemos decirlo de, de, de varias maneras, pero estas son las más comunes. Puedes decir, no, I don't mind, please. No, 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 me, no me molesta, please. O podemos decir, no, go ahead. No, go ahead significa que es como dale. Es como, ah, dale. Eso significa no go ahead, ¿eh? No, adelante. ¿Ok? So that's it. No, I don't mind, please. O oh, no, go ahead. Ya. ¿Estamos más o menos claros hasta ahí, Alex? Sí, 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 sí. Este, sí, la, la duda era porque era como una pregunta, digamos, directa o... o... Es directa, pero, es directa pero amable. Ajá, amablemente. Se pide Ajá, las cosas. Es, es amablemente, sí. Ahora, está... Eso es porque la gente a veces, no, bueno, normalmente sí se, se tiene que ser amable porque si no se escucha muy rudo uno. Sí. Ahí le están la, la otro, los otros ejemplos. Eh, tenemos dos preguntas y se dice, ¿Do you mind if I open the window? ¿Te molesta si yo, yo abro la ventana? Y dice, I'm sorry, I feel cold, please don't. 
Entonces, aquí dice, lo siento. Realmente, si tengo frío. Así que, por favor, no. ¿Verdad? Le está diciendo, hey, abro la ventana. Y te dice, eh, tengo frío. Por favor, no. Entonces, para ser amable. Aunque simplemente le puedes decir esto. Please don't. Por favor, no. Abro la ventana. Por favor, no. Pero puedes decir, I'm sorry if you don't, so please don't. O imagínate que estás con tu esposa y tú estás muy ocupado haciendo una tarea o trabajando. Y te dice, do you mind if I turn on the TV? Te molestas sin siendo la tele. Y vos le puedes decir, I'm sorry, I'm sorry right now. Mira, ah, disculpa, pero estoy estudiando ahora, ahorita. Ya. Yeah. Sí, ya. Yeah. Sí, ya. Yeah. Entonces, como este para ser amable, es, es como, y principalmente para el trabajo en la cuestión formal, pues, se, se utiliza de esa manera. ¿Ok? Ajá, sí. sería eso. Bueno, si querés, eh, léeme unas cuantas, ¿verdad? Porque solo nos queda okay. como un minuto. Ok, vamos con estas dos. Do you mind? Do you mind close, closing the door? The door. Uh -huh. Vamos con la siguiente. Do you mind speaking aloud? Aloud. Okay. Excelente, aloud. Allow. Vamos con esa. Do you mind if I close the window? Mm -hmm. Next. Do you mind if I smoke? Smoke or como se dice? Smoke here. Smoke here. Mm, excellent. Good. Do you, you mind if I sit here? Do you mind if I sit here? Mm -hmm. Vamos con la otra. Do you mind if I live? Earlier. Here. Earlier. Yes. Earlier. Mm -hmm. Excelente. Muy yeah. bien. Vamos con la, las respuestas. No. No, I don't mean please. Please. Mm -hmm. ¿Y la otra? No, I... go ahead. Go ahead. Excelente. Excelente. Good, good. Vamos con la, eh, la otra pregunta. These are questions and answers. Son respuestas amables, pero un poquito largas. Vamos. Do you mind? Do you mind if I open the window? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I feel cold, cold or cold? Cold. Mm -hmm. Cold. cold. Mm -hmm. So please don't. So please don't. Mm -hmm. Vamos con la siguiente. Do you mind if I turn on the TV? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I am studying right now. Right now, excellent. Ok, Alex, has mejorado tu pronunciación. Fíjate, puedo escuchar que ahora estás solo. Lo único que te falta es un poquito más de fluidez. Más rápida, sí. pero la pronunciación a comparación del módulo pasado ha mejorado, sí, bastante. Solo que sí necesitamos practicar un poquito más, más para fluidez, porque la pronunciación ahí vamos, oíste. Alex, terminamos hasta acá, oíste. Así bueno. que, pues, ok, te veo mañana entonces, ok. Bueno, feliz noche. Ok, bye bye.